Assalamu alaikum my beautiful viewers welcome to a new video and I hope you're all well alhamdulillah I'm all good as well today it is another video of making makandi halwa one of my favorite halwas and one of a must when it comes to Eid so I thought I'll share this with you um, so this is what we have so we have suji and milk and what we do is we obviously put the milk and we mix it all all of it with suji you can see like <laughs> i think the bowl was too small here for me i should have had a bit of a bigger bowl um but yeah it did the job at the end as you can see that's all mixed well what i do is i just cover it um and then once that's covered i leave it for a minimum 30 minutes but it's entirely up to yourself like i said a minimum 30 minutes is perfect but if you have the choice of leaving overnight why not now i'm using my electric pan first time so i thought i'll share it with you guys as well so what i've done is i've added ghee and i've added my dried um nuts um it's all up to you obviously your personal choice but what i've added is almonds pistachios and raisins and then what i've done is i've just mixed them all together until they are soft and then what i'll do is I'll, you will see towards the end of the video and the middle what i do with these nuts so yeah that's all mixed up and once that's all gone soft and a bit crunchy what i do is i just put it in a bowl and put it on the side until i go on my next step as you can see that's all done brilliant in the same pan what i'm going to do is just add ghee as you can see i'm just putting all the ghee in the rest of the ghee in there and once it it's all melted then we obviously go to the next step which is going to be adding the sugar now it's entirely up to yourself how much sugar you want to put in depends how much of a sweet tooth you have i personally have a very big sweet tooth so i do i'll add a bit of sugar but obviously it's entirely up to yourself so yeah what you do is once the sugar's added you just keep mixing you have to keep mixing it now this process can take a bit of a while so you do have to have a bit of patience so don't worry about it like i said it's just a bit of a teamwork if you need some help <laughs> um, but yeah you know just keep mixing it and when it turns a bit like this when it's a bit brown that's perfect that's when you add your mixture you know what you left on the side the soji and the milk and then you just keep mixing it so yeah like i said you just need to keep mixing this as you can see it's a bit of a struggle soon as you put that mixture in but that's pretty normal you just need to have a bit of patience and keep mixing this can take a bit of a while um, and you just keep mixing obviously when it comes to um, also i just want to add it needs to be in high flame um, and then once it becomes something like this um, then you can add your cardamom and this is entirely uh, an optional um you can also add gavra water um so it's entirely optional as well i didn't have any gavra water so i didn't add it so like i said a bit of patience and then the halva will start coming uh, to its place keep mixing like i said you have to keep mixing because you don't want it to get stuck on the pan when it does obviously look like this you're like basically towards the end of the process and you're just about to obviously eat so you just need to garnish you know what i just added um did obviously at the beginning and so i've added all the all them garnishing with the nuts um and then you just keep mixing for another few minutes and then it's basically done it needs to be like this the makandi halwa needs to be like a bit sticky um and that's it as you can see it was one of the daisy breakfast for us if you've seen my previous video you'll know as well so i made halva i've made journey uh, and i also made a uh, puris uh, if you want to see how i made the fluffy soft uh, puris then by all means go to my previous videos and you'll be able to see on there i will also be showing you how to make the journals as well on the upcoming uh, videos but thank you very much for watching guys that's it for today i hope you enjoyed the video